we came in and have a look at it and try to spot the differences and uh, that's really hard. I, I, I mean I can't actually, unless I looked at them side by side I wouldn't have a clue what I was looking at in that respect. But, you know, it, it's hugely valuable, especially talking to the designers about what they've learned off other boats and try to incorporate and what the philosophy is. When Oracle first launched its boat and Artemis launched their boat, we saw things that we thought were really smart and one form or the other then incorporated here. If you're a billionaire funded, you, PR is not important, um, or less, certainly less important, but when you are sponsored, government funded, got a uh, uh, New Zealand public that's interested in what you're doing, I think it's important that, we, you know, that we're open. Well, it's vital for us to have a vague idea of what's going on. You know, the, the level of excitement with this is that, as Nick Holrod was saying, these are always just 10% away from flying apart. And unlike any other edition, well, we've had collisions and rigs going and the sails exploding, you can repair those quite quickly. You can't with these. You can't actually make that mistake because you're going to be doomed if you do. So every single day that these boats go out now, uh, it's going to be on the edge. And I think you know, our job is to make people realise that and realise how compelling it's going to be, knowing that you know, this is sailing on the edge of America's Cup like never before.